you are doing it, you know, and uh, nice of you to not be leaving him alone. Uh, and I understand there is a nephew, no, who also kind of supervises him. Yes, yes it is. You. Willie Dean Johnson. Oh, where is Mr. Briar originally from himself? He's from Georgetown, Georgia. Okay. And uh, was he ever married? His own children, or no? No, he don't. He never been married, and never, he don't have any children either. Hmm. So he's used to being independent and doing for himself and yeah. being his own boss. Wow. Yes, he was very independent up to until yeah. uh, July the eighth. Wow. Of last month, till he had that stroke. So he was a tough cookie, huh? and then. Uh, it must be not very easy for someone like that, independent and always did for himself, to suddenly be dependent. Um, and a little bit defenseless, if you will. Uh, and I understand that he has two sisters? Uh, he has, um, let me see. Well, see, Larry, he has one sister on his mother's side that is still living. And then he has okay. three sisters sisters on his daddy's side and a brother that is living. So, total of five siblings. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, four sisters and one brother. Now, who makes medical decisions um, in general uh, for him? I, there is, I think, one main sister, right? Um, a main sister? Like who? Let me see. I saw some, somewhere that, uh, who makes medical decisions? Are you the one who makes medical decisions? Well, Willie, Dean, just... Willie Dean Johnson was the one that was trying to help su you know, supervise, uh -huh. you know, to make sure that he got in the nursing home and all of that, you know. Uh -huh. And I was assisting him. The team leader. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Willie Dean Johnson was the team leader. He is the team leader. Okay. Oh, it's him. Okay. Let's see. Oh, sisters. Let me see. Um... And two, how is he doing today? I mean, honestly, about the same. Like his vital signs are stable. His the things like blood pressure is a little bit on the high side, but that changes also depends on whether he's agitated. I mean, but uh, breathing is within normal limits. His oxygen within normal li limits. Heart rate within normal limits. Is he perfect? No, but he's kind of stabilized, uh, and, and he has a tad bit of anemia. Mm -hmm. And how is this uh, temperature today? It's all right. Like all right, yeah, like, okay. like 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 what? No, normal, normal, ninety-eight point eight, normal limit. Oh, okay. Normal. Well, that's good because I just found out last night that his temperature had went up to over a hundred and three. Right. Yes, see, it had. And uh, he was placed on the ninth floor, and we didn't even—I didn't even know that mm -hmm. until yesterday that he was mm -hmm. even because no one ever notified us. So, uh, 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 right now, what do you say your name is again? Uh, my name is Bikova. I can um, spell my name and I can give you phone number if you like. Okay, let me get a pen and paper. Hold on a second. Okay, you can spell it for me. P is in Peter. E Y. K O V is in Victor, A is in Apple. Okay, what's your first name? D is in David, E L I A N A. Okay, I wrote it down. You said a phone number? Uh, 706-660-660? Yes, ma'am. 6471. 